And this is why I love clothes. Sometimes capitalism wins. Sometimes there is something to it, okay? Because I was in such a bad mood today, okay? I did not want to leave my house. I had no intention of exiting the premises, okay? And I had already agreed to plans and I was this close to canceling. But then I remembered I have this really cute outfit and so I forced myself to do my hair and my makeup and now I feel so cute. I feel like this looks so good. It would actually be a disservice to the city streets if I don't go out tonight looking this good. People need to see how cute I look. Okay, wait, let me show you the full fit. You gotta get the full effect. Okay, also I just moved, like I'm still in the process of moving so i'm really sorry for the mess but anyway this is the outfit are you joking is this not the cutest dress you've ever seen i love her so much i think i'm pretty much ready to go um the last thing i got to do before i leave the last step to getting ready okay arguably the most important step okay is i gotta pick out my perfume for the night i love perfume so much okay i've talked about this before it's like a whole obsession i don't think you guys understand how passionate i am about my perfumes i especially love like more unique scents that are long lasting but also super affordable and i just got a bunch of perfumes from this brand that i thought we could try together and maybe we can pick one that best fits the outfit the vibe you know this is the brand i think it's pronounced a Huja, but I'm not 100% sure. Um, correct me if I'm wrong. <laughs> Just kidding. I'm never wrong. I'm perfect. Thank you. This one is called Sacred Centel. Oh, also all of these are Eau de Parfum, not Eau de Toilette, which is good because Eau de Parfum lasts a lot longer. Ooh, that smells so good. That is right up my alley. That's normally the kind of perfume that I would usually go for. It's very like earthy, woody, a little bit spicy. There's a leather quality to it. It's very strong, but very smooth. It's very, um, what's the word? Decadent. Ooh, that is such a good word. That's a big word for Elma. This one is called Blossomy. I love tuberose so much. It is one of the top notes that I look for in fragrances. It is one of my favorite scents. And the top note in this is tuberose. So I, I think I might go with this tonight. This is their women's fragrance. Um, it's definitely very feminine compared to the others. I think it's a little bit more appropriate for daytime. Um, there's vanilla notes in there as well as iris and jasmine so i think this is better for daytime this is another unisex fragrance it's called majestic oud um the top note is obviously oud as well as patchouli a little bit of vanilla and raspberry this is really nice i really really like this too again very much up my alley the last one is called rouge fusion i think we might have saved the best for last because i love this um it's a little bit citrus forward but there's a sweetness and warmth from the vanilla note in this i don't really know how to describe it but again it's very decadent very licentious it's so good i think this one is my favorite and obviously it's the one i'm going with tonight i just feel like it fits the vibe the best i feel like if i could describe this perfume with an outfit it would be this outfit you know the citrusy notes it's a little bit fun but sexy but also sweet and a little bit unique it worked out perfectly this is the final look let me know what you think um okay that's it love you bye